Time marches on and countries are taking sides for their safety and preparing for a likely war. It is a wise step to take in a world that is in a turmoil and breaking down. It is yours and it has been for many years with no apparent care for other life forms. You have a duty whilst upon earth to look after them yet many species are disappearing at an alarming rate through neglect. The situation is not helped by climate changes that are also taking their toll. You should know that if you upset the balance of nature it will rebound on you in next to no time. Accept your responsibilities and take action before it is too late. The changes have been anticipated for a long time and have come when the present life cycle is about to close as another one opens. No one will lose out indeed all will find that an advancement has taken place that has lifted you out of the negativity that is rampant at this time in your experiences. We tell you again that Mother Gaia has already started her cleansing of the planet. It is inevitable that humanity will be caught up in the changes taking place and as much care as possible is being taken to minimize death or injuries. However, some of it will still be the result of karma yet to be cleared. We have anticipated the outcome of your troubled times and we are here in great numbers to ensure that matters do not get out of hand, as the prime concern for the events to come is your safe existence during them. The events are such that many other civilizations are very interested to witness the ascension. They are not allowed to interfere with the outcome that is monitored the whole of the time by us. So you will be able to ascend and what a relief it will be after all the trauma you will have experienced. Allow events to reflect your determination to come through your experiences safe and sound. Some changes will inevitably result in deaths but they have been anticipated and those souls involved will be cared for and looked after. If you can look at it as an exciting time to be on earth and personally witness the changes that are part of the upliftment of earth to the higher realms. You are in fact privileged to be on it at such an important time and witness such happenings. If you can look at it as a positive time it will be a much easier to experience. They are carrying you forward in preparation for major changes that will take place in most of your lifetimes. Indeed, you have been preparing for this time when you shall benefit from all the effort you have put in over many lives. It has been a slow but positive advancement that we have guided you through to ensure you are ready for the changes that are taking place now. You are keeping the momentum of change going in spite of the apparent breakup of your civilization. It is in a time of destruction and changes of things that you know as normal and tend to take for granted. Yet out of the confusion and breakdown of what you consider your normal way of life to be, are changes that will set you upon the path to a more acceptable and better way of life. Meantime you are experiencing changes that are not always of your choice, but one day when you look back to this period you will fully understand the necessity of them. We would not wish to disguise the fact that present times are very difficult to deal with as for some of you your world is being turned upside down, or so it may seem. But all coming changes are necessary to prepare you for greater things that will be most acceptable and to your liking. As the changes become more widespread so they shall affect more and more people, as in one way or another all shall be affected by them. Your trials and tribulations will become less impacting upon you as the purpose of them becomes apparent. Dear ones, we paint a picture not of pain and gloom but one that promises you a great and exciting future. It will be so different to what you have been used to and no doubt exceed your expectations. Peace and harmony beckon but first the necessary changes must take place. So move forward with every assurance it will be much more than you could imagine taking away the demands made upon you by the old style of life that gives you so many problems to deal with. For many some of the older parts of your world have barely existed when compared to what you call your modern cities. Inequality has always existed, but all that will end with the changes that are coming. All experiences of value and bear in mind that it is carefully chosen to give the best opportunities to advance your evolution. If in any respect you have failed to advance yourself, bear in mind that there will always be another opportunity to do so. Clearly some souls need more time to evolve, and as one cycle ends another one begins giving another opportunity to advance and it will always be so. You are cared for much more than you possibly realize, so never think that you are left alone to make progress. We are present at all times to keep you to your life plan and protect you from harm that could seriously hold up your progress. What you call miracles often are the result of such protection, as we have powers far beyond your imagination. 
it is in our interest to ensure you complete your life plans successfully, although we have to allow your free will choice if you desire to take a different path. We accept that it is your choice that counts and if you desire a particular experience not in your life plan we will not stand in your way. We look upon you as very brave souls who knew what risks you were undertaking by reincarnating, although you always have the assurance that we would be by your side to guide you and protect you unless karma was involved. Although you reincarnate with a limited memory that is appropriate to your life plan the greater picture will show you as a mature experienced traveler. You are a great soul and have achieved so much more than you can conceive at present. However, once you return to the higher levels again you will have full recollection. I leave you with love and blessings, and may the light brighten your days and path to completion. This message comes through my higher self my God self, and every soul has the same connection to God. In love and light. Mike Quincy